Today we have we are here to celebrate a victory for the Bangsamoro people and the Filipino nation that is shared by the international community and the Muslim world. A victory earned not by war, but by that collective desire tempered by the inner nobility of human nature to restore justice and peace to a troubled land. Today, we are here to put an end to the adversarial relationship between the Bangsamoro and the Philippine nation. And what makes this more significant and quite touching on our part is that this is happening under the administration of President Noy Noy Aquino. <laughs> whose martyred father, Senator Ninoy Aquino and mother, the late President Cory Aquino, fought on the same side of defense with us against the dictatorship that devastated our homeland and snuffed the lives of thousands of our people. Today, we extend the hands of friendship and partnership to the President and the Filipino people as we jointly embark on the historic journey to rebuild our homeland, institute justice and occupation, and the reign of violence, and restore normalcy to the lives of the masses of our people in Mindanao and Sulu with the framework agreement on the Bangsamoro. We pray never to see again refugee camps cramped with old folks, women and children wallowing in squalor and misery, as well as, as well as never again witness the recurring wholesale violation of human rights that comes with oppression, all of which deface the landscape of our Bangsamoro homeland and the, 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 the great denigrate the, ho the holy, the lofty human values long held by a civilized and just society. Today, I would also like to announce to all that we dedicate this framework agreement on the Bangsamoro to our departed leaders, the late MILF German Salamat Hashim, the late MILF Vice Chairman, Vice Chairman Alim Abdulaziz Mimbatas, Ustaz Abu Khalil Yahya, Ustaz Zainun Zaman, among others, and to all our Mujahideen martyrs, whether MILF or MNLF. <laughs> they sacrificed their lives for the cause of Allah and for the Bangsamoro. To them and to all the peace-loving people in, in this country, this agreement shall stand as our greatest tribute. Let me also have this opportunity to call on an appeal to our MNLF brethren to support the framework agreement and take this historic journey with us to rebuild our Bangsamoro homeland on the gains given to us by the agreement. This is not the time for recriminations. This is the time for unity. The time for all of us to think, act, and speak as one Bangsamoro as we summon all our strengths to face the daunting task of home rule. Finally, on behalf of the Bangsamoro people and the more Islamic Liberation Front, may I extend our heartfelt thanks to His Excellency President Benigno Simon Aquino III, His Excellency Prime Minister Dato Sri Nagib Tun Abdurazak, His Excellency Dr. Mahathir Muhammad, the former Prime Minister in, in whose term of office peace negotiations were done in Malaysia, to His Excellency Iqmeluddin Ihsanoglu, Secretary General of the Organization of Islamic Conference, Islamic Cooperation, OIC, 
and to the Malaysian Facilitator and Secretariat. Likewise, to all the state and non-state actors that compose the International Contact Group, ICG, the Government of the United Kingdom, Turkey, Turkey Saudi Arabia, Japan, and its international NGO components, Constellation Resources, Muhammadiyah, the Asia Foundation, and uh, Center for Humanitarian Dialogue, the International Monitoring Team, or the IMT, and its civilian protection component, Malaysia, Brunei, Libya, Japan, Norway, Indonesia, Mindanao People's Caucus, Mindanao Human Rights Action Center, and Muslim Organization of Government Officials and Professionals, and to us, world organizations and that sent their message of support to the framework agreement such as the United Nations, the European Union, the United States of America, the United Kingdom, Switzerland, Australia, Indonesia, Japan, and the Organization of Islamic Cooperation, as well as to those individuals and groups in and out of the, our homeland, believe in the justice of our coast and who were with us through thick and thin in our long struggle for justice and peace. We convey our sincerest gratitude. Thank you. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala be with all of us. Wa billahi tawfiq wal hidayah. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.